I joined DSTL last year after finishing my degree in physical natural sciences at Cambridge, but having worked at DSTL before university on a summer placement. As a physicist at heart, but with a passion for people and a forces background, I knew this was the field I wanted to work in, and it's a really unique and valuable opportunity to do at PhysEvents. I really like the idea of helping people, being able to um, contribute towards research that may one day go in towards uh, trying to find treatment for diseases. I've only been here a year, but through internal training modules and practical experience, I'm already signed off as a radiation protection support technician, which means I can lead on visits and author reports, and that's also been reflected in my pay grade. I've also recently become the deputy PTA for one of the bigger contracts, the project for the Navy. So that gives me some experience of, of that sort of higher level um, project technical leadership. When we're in the office, and besides all the normal job admin and organisational stuff, um, anything from emails to radiographers and radiologists, reviewing documents, completing training assignments, writing risk assessments and local rules, making spreadsheets uh, for quality assurance or analysing dose audit data, doing my own reading or consolidation or watching a webinar, organising visits and booking hotels. And then when we're on visits, driving, uh, chatting to Army, Navy, RAF, medical staff and overseeing officers. Um, looking through documentation, assessing protocols and practices, and most importantly, checking for radiation contamination and testing equipment. It's the work-life balance, it's really good. Um, so you have a certain amount of hours you have to do a week, 37 I think. Um, and it doesn't really matter when you do them, um, so there's flexi time. How unique our role is. We're a team of two medical physicists, whereas most NHS hospitals would have a team of about eight to 10, at least, depending on their size. That not only means our work is hands-on and involved, but we have good relationships with our customers and what we do really matters. It has tangible impact and importance. Sometimes we really have to deliver at pace and are really valued as part of operational teams. I love getting to be a scientist, but work with and for people. Seeing physics where it really matters makes all the difference and the colleagues I work with really make the job. I've gone to a few international conferences now, one in Cape Town, which was awesome. Um, and I've gone, well, I've gone and did a, a, a visit to Brunei. Um, so that was really cool. Uh, I think my ship visits have been the most fun as I've never done anything like that before. I've been on the Royal Fleet Auxiliary Argus, which is amazing because when you're in the hospital department, you feel like you could be anywhere, let alone floating on a ship. Uh, recently, I went on the Queen Elizabeth, one of the nation's two aircraft carriers, and they're just incredible. Also going on validation exercise with 3-4 Field Hospital, where they run through scenarios to practice their roles was remarkable. It was really interesting to see how they respond to casualties like they would in theatre, and to be part of enabling that to happen is just such a privilege.